Right, now let's talk to a familiar face first. There we go, it's you. How are you doing? Just like that, perfect. I don't remember the voice I gave her. Grawawa? Hey, wait a minute. Don't I know you from somewhere? That's right, my old partner. How are you, partner? I mean, Jay. Whoa, parent, that's her name, of course. That's right, good old Perrin is still kicking around. You're doing well yourself, eh? I sure appreciate all the help, uh, appreciated all the help you gave me back in Kitakami, tracking down the Blood Moon Beast. I never thought I'd just bump into you like this. How about I teach you a new pose to celebrate? The looking good emote. Cool. Oh, but what, uh, what about that Growlithe I entrusted you? Is he doing alright? I hope you put him on your team sometimes and do a bit of adventure, uh, adventuring together. Grrr. I must admit I have not done that yet. So, you're here as some sort of exchange student, huh? Nice! What a coincidence. I just started working here as a photographer, of course. That's amazing. <laughs> yeah, it pretty much is, right? Though, I'm still sort of waiting to hear if the school likes my work, to be fair. They say they want snapshots of the terrarium and the students and all for upcoming marketing stuff. So, how about some photos of you? Ah, speaking of photos, I've got a hot tip I could let you in on. But if I told you, I bet you'd just go running right off. How about this? I'll snap some candid shots of you catching tons of Pokemon in the terrarium. Don't worry, you won't even notice I'm nearby. If I make enough headway in my work by the time you register, say, 200 Pokemon in the Blueberry, text, uh, blueberry Dex, I'll share that hot tip. Okay. Okay, so is, is th that a 200 uh, thing as well? Is that... Okay, we don't know. We don't know yet. Okay, so there's a bunch of stuff. I've transferred some older, like some Legends Arceus Pokemon in here. So, no uh, reason to wonder why uh, all of a sudden some of them are in the decks when last time I didn't have any. Okay, so, um, that's... All right. I... Right, I got one in uh, from Arceus, but I didn't evolve it yet. Right, that's why it's missing. Okay. Ah, there they are. I also transferred in an Empoleon and a Chimchar from home. Yeah. Iron... Iron leaves? Did I... Wait, did I... Did I ever get one of those? Maybe I traded one? <laughs> I don't remember ever catching one of those because I don't really like the raids. So, uh... Okay, let's see. Uh, let's take a look at the map. Okay, we are here. Okay, so... We just go north to the uh, coastal biome. Okay. So it is just in uh, radial quarters. Okay, that makes sense. Let's just slowly make our way up and catch stuff we uh, happen to come across. I don't know if we still need to heal, but let's just use that station. Uh, heal my Pokemon. No dialogue and all that. That's just... that's just nice. Miascarada and the other Pokemon are all better now. Okay. Now let's see. What's that? Oh, a Doduo. Don't think I'm gonna be using it, but I'll be catching it. Hello there. I do think it's cute, but... You know, it's not really one I'm, I'm that excited for. It's good that it's back, but... Oh, I'm running out of quick balls, huh? Well, damn. I'm gonna have to buy some more. I don't know if there's like quick balls for purchase in this academy, but I'm sure somewhere there's a shop, right? Dodua was caught. There we go. Uh, Dodua, twin bird Pokemon. Its heads never sleep at the same time. Each one takes a turn keeping watch while the other sleeps, switching every hour or so. Um, I'm not planning on using it, so no thanks. I'm gonna send it to the box. There we go. Oh, it's number one in the Pokedex. Good to know. Is there a shop here or something? Heal him up. You, you just say heal him up. 
What's in those machines? Uh, purchase, I'd like to buy. Okay, that's healing items. Oh, Pokeballs as well. Quick balls, there we go. There we go, now that's better. Let's just take 40. Beautiful. That's much better. I'm good. Thanks. Alright, now let's head off. Mododuo. Is that execute? It is, it is, okay. Also not really planning on using that one, <laughs> admittedly, but say, hey, we need it for the decks anyway, so let's quickly throw a ball at it. That should catch, right? Come on now, one, two, three, thank you. Execute was caught. Alright. The egg Pokemon Grass Psychic. Using telepathy, only fellow Execute can pick up on. They always form a cluster of six. No. No, I'm not using that one. <laughs> Sorry. I... Yeah, okay, there we go. That's the second Pokemon in the deck. More Execute. How about a double battle? Uh, let's switch you out for Pop Rocks. There we go. And let's battle you. See what you have. Think you're good at double battles? Why don't you test that theory by battling me? Gladly. Oh, there's a Dodrio already, so we don't even have to evolve it, we can just catch it. Uh, Darius the student, okay. Dodrio and Volibi, okay. Well, one of my choices was good. Um, all right. You're gonna U-turn out of here, and you are going to Thunderbolt the Doduo. There we go. Now, they're probably gonna try to hit flying type attacks on Meowth so, um... Who do we send in? I guess you're just strong in general. Yeah, there's no real type advantage there. But, hey, can't hurt to send you out. Thunderbolt, there we go. That does it, of course. Dodo have fainted. Attract! That's what you're going for. That's a bit annoying. Okay. I mean, you can Moonblast this one, and you can try to Thunderbolt. Let's see if that works. Come on. Yeah, there we go. No chance, Vado Boy, no chance. Alright, very good. Now let's see what else there is to see here. You don't have to tell me twice. You're an ace at double battles. Damn right. After all, I've defeated Ryan. But that was in a different timeline, I suppose. Okay, um, let's see. Oh, let's get back on Miraidon. Hyper Potions. Trap Pinch. Oh, that's cool. Oh, there's a regular Tauros. I just saw that from the corner of my eye. Trapinch. Oh, level 56, that's not particularly high. I'll catch it, but maybe we'll, maybe we'll find a higher level Flygon or something, because I would really like that. Uh, Trapinch was caught. There we go. Uh, the Ant Pit Pokemon. As it digs through the sand, its giant jaws crush any rock uh, any rocks that obstruct its path. It builds a funnel-shaped nest. No, not yet, not yet. Um, I'm looking for something else first. Like something a bit higher level than that. But I guess we'll see if that's in the cards. Tauros? Regular Tauros, that is. Let's see. Oh, there's a terrestrialized one as well. Oh, you intimidate me? Let's try a quick ball. Come on, one, two, three. Ah, that was close, but no cigar. Giga Impact. Don't like to see that. Oof. Okay. You know, you know what? We can just defeat this one and catch another one later. Flower Trick uh, ignores the Intimidate. So that should do well enough. There we go. Tauros fainted. 
and on we go. We'll catch it eventually. You know what? For now, I'll just catch the stuff I'm interested in and not this, uh, and not everything. I mean, I've finished the... Oh, there's a Vibrava. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. How, wh what's your level, Vibrava? 66? Now that's closer to it. That's closer to it. Now Vibrava is, of course, kind of weak. One, two, three. Thank you. Let's look at uh, the, you know, the um, nature and all that. Is... Is Flygon... I don't know if it's a physical or special attack. I guess, I guess we'll see if that even matters in this case. Vibrava, the vibration Pokémon, the ground dragon. It generates ultrasonic waves by vigorously vibrating its wings. After making its prey faint, it dissolves the prey with its digestive juices. Delicious. Oh, we can't check for, uh, beforehand. Okay. I'm planning on using a Vibrava, or, well, Flygon most, uh, most importantly. Let's see. What could we call you? I'm gonna have to edit this out again. Must not forget. Your name's gonna be Oregano. Sure, why not? Uh, at the party. Uh, who do we send out? Like, it's a ground type, so maybe Black Forest is gonna leave for now. Um... Uh, let's take the item with us. Soft sand, okay. Let's take a look at uh, what Oregano's stats are like. <sighs> okay, quickly dodge that one. There we go. No, wait, that's the wrong one. That's the Pokedex button. Uh, wait, that's not even what I wanted to do. What the hell? I'm confused today, sorry. Uh, let's check the summary for Oregano. Let's see. Your minus attack plus defense. Okay, let me quickly look at uh, Flygon. Okay, definitely a physical attacker, so we should probably do something about this. Um, do I have a mint or something on me? I think I might have. Doesn't even have to be a mint that strengthens the attack, it just has to be something that doesn't weaken it. That's all I need. Wait, that's not this one. That's also not this one. This one, right? Come on now. Alright, let's see. Careful mint, timid mint. Attack may suffer, that's special defense in favor of special attack, that's speed in favor of attack, that's speed in, in favor of special defense, that's neutral. Okay. I think maybe the speed raising one, that seems decent. Like, just make it a bit faster, that can always help. Yes, let's do that. And also, what's those? Um, Sure, let's add some of that, because let's be real, Flygon is cool, but the stats are a bit lackluster. It's not like, it's not like insanely strong or anything. We need everything we can get to make its uh, attack a bit better. Uh, there we go. Um, sp speed would also be good. Yeah, let's add that. There we go. Like, uh... I just looked at the stats of Flygon and it's like um, 80 health, well, 80 HP. Um, then it's like 100 attack, 80 in defense, special attack, special defense, and then 100 in speed. So it's not really that impressive. But uh, I think with the right natures and a bit of invest investment, we can make it work. Alright, there we go. Trap Inch defeated. There we go. Oh, you immediately want to fight me, huh? Okay, what's your typing? What's your terror type? Fighting type? I'm not a fan of that. Okay, but that means you're most likely either gonna attack me with a normal move or with a um, with a fighting type move. 
which means I'm gonna U-turn. And I'm gonna go into, come on, Habanero, there we go. The item Habanero ca uh, carries is still entirely pointless. I, <laughs> I should really switch that out at some point, but uh, I always forget about it. Okay, Psycho Cut, we can do that. There we go, that should break it. There it is. What are you gonna do now? Nothing, okay. I've... Oh right, we didn't catch that, Thor uh, that Tauros. Let's do that here, I suppose. What do we use? Just a Ultra Ball? Sure. That seems fine. Come on now. One, two, three. And there we go. Thank you very much. Tauros was caught. Is that just the same, like, the same entry as the other Tauros forms, or is it uh, an entirely different one? Let's see. They fight each other by locking horns. The herd's protectors take pride in their battle-scarred horns. Okay. Uh, no nickname, it's fine. Let's send you to the box. I think I should probably just evolve the uh, Vibrava, right? I have some uh, some candies. There we go. Not, not a lot of those, but, uh, you know, make it at least somewhat usable. Let's get it up to level 70, where all the other trainers seem to be. There we go. Now evolve for me and become a majestic Flygon. Come on now. I want to see what it looks like in game. Ah, beautiful. Congratulations. Oregano evolved into Flygon. The mystic Pokemon. The sound of its wings flapping resembles singing. Those entranced by this sound get lured into a sandstorm and become Flygon's prey. Well then. First uh, proper new Pokemon. Dragon Claw. Okay. Forget a move. Earthquake. We will keep that. Ooh, double battles. Wait a second. Double battles. Probably not the best. Boom Burst. Also everyone. Okay. Dragon Rush. Uh, Dragon Rush is 100 and, uh, 175 and this is 8100 and I value the accuracy more than the uh, 20 points in attack. So I'll take that. There we go. And I'm gonna take a look at uh, Flygon's like moves that it can learn now. Come on. Let's check the summary again. Change the moves. Uh, sure, remember moves. Do we have anything cool? Fissure. Oh my god. Okay. We have superpower. Dra Dragon Dance. Okay, 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 okay. If we can afford to do that at some point, it would be very nice to have. Let's do that instead of Boom Burst. Like, Boom Burst is strong, but this place is full of double battles. Can't use Boom Burst in that. Unless I have very specific, um, you know, Pokemon on my team at the moment. Okay, let's see. What else can you learn? What else do you have? Bug Buzz. Do we want Bug Buzz as coverage? What would that cover for? That would cover for Grass, for Dark, for um, Psychic. I mean, I guess it's probably not bad, right? Bulldoze. Mm, okay. You know what? No, it's a, spe it's a special move. Don't need that. Sorry. Uh, superpower? We could do that. Maybe instead of uproar? Sure. Let's do that instead of uproar and I'm gonna quickly look at my uh, TMs and see if I have like another ground type move that I could use instead of earthquake. Let's look at the TMs. Mud slabs, not particularly great. Bulldoze, no. Mud shot, terrible rock tomb. Dragon tail, endure sunny day, sandstorm, dig. Air Slash, Fire Punch, Thunder Punch, Rest, Rock Slide, Fly, Substitute, Crunch, Tailwind, Dragon Pulse, Stealth Rock, Heat Wave, Flamethrower, Helping Hand, Earth Power, Special type, a special move though, sadly, a Stone Edge, etc. Unfortunately, not really. Uh, what do we do instead? Do we just keep Earthquake or do we go for Dig? 
I might just go for Dig instead. Like, sure, in like a one-on-one -on -one battle with another real person, that would be intensely exploitable. Wait, we have Dig in that learn set as well, right? Uh, yeah, uh, in like a real battle against a real person, that would be incredibly exploitable, but this is just, you know, AI, uh, or like bot opponents, and those will be fine just eating Digs over and over again. Okay, Flygon is finally on the team. Let's see. Hyper Potion. Petra Berry. What else do we have around here? Okay, you want to battle? We could do that. I could probably just um, put Flygon in second place. Yeah, change position. You know where Pop Rocks used to be. Oh, that's just a, a, a wild, re uh, not Relor, uh, Rapska. That's cool. Oh, there's uh, Dupai does as well. Sorry to bother you, but uh, do you know where we are? I'm completely lost. Armin the student, okay. Ooh, a Sandile. Oh, I'm gonna become a, a ground type trainer here. <laughs> if it keeps going like this. All right. We will U-turn out. I guess, I, hmm, what do we go for here? Yeah, I guess against Mandibus. And you're gonna Dragon Claw the, uh, the Vibrava. That seems fine. There we go. Who do we bring in? I think the obvious ch choice would be uh, Kilowattrol. There we go. There we are. Yeah, the Vibrava doesn't live that. Very nice. Oh, that hits quite hard, huh? Okay, we're gonna Thunderbolt you. And we're gonna Dragon Claw you. There we go. That's better. All right. Armin defeated. Ooh, Seb Striker. So sorry for the poor show in battle too. I like Seb Striker. Don't think it's strong, but looks cool. Do we use one? Uh, I don't know. I don't know if we use one. I'm definitely gonna catch it, but uh, honestly, I. I think I used one when I played uh, black and white, uh, but it wasn't particularly good, so uh, Sub Striker was caught. I don't think I'm gonna use that one. Would be cool if it evolved or something, but I haven't heard anything of that. To be fair, I didn't look at spoilers or anything, but, but still, you know. Uh, once the herd hears thunder, it chases after the storm clouds so that the Blitzel in the group can use the lightning to charge up. No. Uh, send to the boxers. There we go. Oh yeah, there's something directly after it. It does not evolve in this one. Smeagol? Just wanna look at me like that? Okay. Let's catch you, but... Like, Smeagol's not going on the team. We would have to sketch out a whole moveset for it, I assume. Uh, it still works like that. Oh, you didn't? Uh, you don't want to get caught? Sketch? Failed. Alright. Come on. Leftovers kick in, and um, what do we do? Night Slash? Yeah, okay, that's fine. I've seen others before. We'll find it again eventually. Uh, now it's at least a scene in the decks, so we can always just ask the decks where it is. What do we have around here? Let's see, let's see, let's see. Anything cool in the water? As a Bruxish, we have that already. What's... Is that a... Oh, that's a Tynamo, okay. I couldn't make out what that was under the water. 
But that's not particularly interesting. We have one of those anyways. Let's flower trick it real quick for the XP. I'm sure that should do it, right? Yeah, there we go. Okay. Dupider, I'm gonna... I don't think we have that in, in the decks yet. I think that's a new one. Let's change position to uh, Pop Rocks. Because we don't want to get hit by a bug type move if we fail to catch. Let's... Uh...